Hey folks, what's up? It's Ash. Hey, and it's Stassi. From Andy's Daily Dose Hemp, Hemp Reviews. Reviews. Uh, if you didn't catch us a little bit ago, uh, actually it's probably been about 45 minutes or so yep. now. Um, we got, from Thomas, at Relief Buddies, a CBD brownie. Which are gluten free. Gluten free and? Dairy. Dairy free. So if you have a gluten allergy or a dairy allergy, None of that's in here. Nope. Um, Free and clear. You now, can eat all you want. The brownie that we, we got is 70 milligrams. Yes. Um, CBD. And I think they said, what, it was the Electra? Yes, the Sweet Electra. The Sweet Electra is what they use in this. And and the Electra is one of our favorites. Oh, as I far know. As a flower I love goes. that show. Uh, amazing. So. Especially Relief Buddies. Yes. yes, yes <laughs> I'm Thomas, just saying, you guys, like, you guys, yeah. You guys like, are doing amazing <laughs> things at your farm out there. I don't, I don't know what you guys are doing, but it is amazing. Okay, um, first of all, we have to say, um, if you're 18 or younger, please. Take a hike. Step in. This is all 100% hemp legal. Mm -hmm. No no marijuana here whatsoever. This is all this is all farm-grown hemp uh, that's used. Organic. Yes. Legal. Organic. Legal. Um... This is a full spectrum brownie. This, uh, as Thomas has said himself, uh, what do you call it? A afternoon snack or a late midnight night snack. midnight snack, something like that. My favorite. I will say this. Forty-five minutes ago, I was like, "Yeah, I eat this." You know, when you wake up in the morning, I'm going to tell you right now. Who's the skeptic? I'm I'm pretty relaxed. I don't do edibles. I'm not a I'm not an edibles guy. I'm not a never have been. Don't have anything against them. Edibles are great. And um, me being an ex pastry chef, I'm sorry, but I she, I've experimented a few right. times. Oh, so this 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 here is is definitely good. So, I would say yeah. 45 minutes into that, um, we 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 did not eat the whole thing. No, we did. Uh, which, 70 milligrams between two people. That you split that in half. That's would. 35, 35. We don't eat the rest of it. We, right we, right. we eat the rest of it now. Um, I will say this, you, uh, you take about half of that, that's about all you really need. Um, I mean, all for, he needed. for a nice relaxing, <laughs> for a nice relaxing, um, you know, uh, I mean. Honestly, it, yeah, it does relax you. It actually 70 milligrams is, is, is I wouldn't say too much, but um, half of that, half of that is, I mean, you, that's, you, you could, you could. That could be a double dose for you, man. Halfway through the day, you need to get a good relaxation. Eat that. Half hour later, I wish I could feel just loose. Explain to them the flavor, Thomas. I want to say this: the flavor, whatever you guys are doing the there, uh, that the flavor, the texture, the moisture level is amazing, amazing. Um, we have all had edible brownies at some point in our life, and you remember saying, "Oh, wow, man, you can really taste that." Any true purveyor of the um, hemp industry that would, there would know tastes like a real freaking brownie. Like you, you almost have to say, "Wait a minute, is this?" Did an grandma edible? make this? Or did my grandmother make this? <laughs> yeah, it tastes that okay, good. Okay, I your might eat the whole is, damn thing if you don't. Your, 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 your recipe <laughs> is is amazing. Um, and it's so okay. It's you don't need no right now, but. Yeah, you don't need milk. You don't need milk. I mean, don't get me wrong. Milk would go great with it. Yeah. But you don't need it. It's not a necessity. It's not one of those where your mouth... Where you're just dries like... ...dries out. And you're like... Oh, yeah, yeah I need that. No. It's none of that. Um, oh. It's made with the lip for strain. And... So... And, no, and, and it has Sweet Electra. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, it's Sweet Electra. And it has... Sweet Electra. It has... Um, very light hemp tones. Mm hmm. You I mean, how, you almost have to look for them. You know how when um, you cook with it, hemp that is, and it can be overpowering. Yeah. You know, even like, it's almost like um, like pesto. Pesto yeah. is overpowering. It's and, you know, a little bit goes a long way. A very, yeah. So. They, and for, for 70 milligrams, for it to taste that amazing, you can I, barely there's a taste reason it. I don't I mean, do a lot of edibles, okay? And my reason is, is <laughs> you know, do, you, you'll see Dee and Blair, and Blair, this is not a cut on you. Um, you, you, you like to do the uh, the taste test, and I've done it with you. Um, I'm not big on the flavor of, of, of the, the plant itself, unless I'm, you know. Uh, but, yeah, he's but more Thomas, of a <laughs> You guys right here. This is this is this like this gives me, me this gives me some great um, 
things to 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 look no forward and trying to, to to make you know. Oh, hey, Trixie. Hey, Trixie, how you doing? <laughs> Uh, that's Trixie. She's coming to say hi. She said hi, everybody. Um, me being a chef, I've always wanted to make some Trixie? edibles, but the one thing I want to do mm -hmm. is I don't want the hemp flour to, to overpower the flavor of the food that I'm serving. You guys have hit the nail on the head when it comes to these brownies. Now, I don't know if you have other edibles or not. I need to get back on your website. Check out ReliefBuddies.com, I believe is what it is. Uh, Thomas, from there, they, they've got all kinds of stuff. Oh, um, yeah. Go, go check these guys out. Uh, I'm going to get back on the website, and I'm going to see what other, other you know, edibles they may have. I will say this, guys, if you are an edible fan, or if you're skeptical. They know what they're doing. Check these guys out. It's this great, is too, for uh, people with allergies. Um, yes. You know, the gluten-free. Gluten and, and dairy-free. And dairy-free. Yeah. So so, I, have, I have dairy issues, so this is perfect for, for yeah. somebody like myself. I mean, it's just, it's, and it's amazing. And anybody who's just on a gluten-free diet yeah. or yeah, if you're, you know, medically need it to be gluten-free. Yep. yep, these guys are very, very aware, uh, aware of, you know, things that, uh, you know, people things have issues that matter too. So, yeah, exactly. You know, when you take, take something for a medicinal use, obviously you do not want to have another side effect. Right. Um, we have know. enough side effects out there. Right. Like, we're, we're trying to curb the side effects. That, 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 that's that like my good. biggest pet peeve about big pharma, for, uh, like pharmaceuticals and stuff. You, yeah. um, you have one thing that it fixes, but then it causes this whole laundry list of fucking other problems that are like, wow, why am I taking this By again? By the way, shut up, the <laughs> Mr. Roots. This is a uh, cherry picker from Mr. Roots. Oh, yeah. Chris out there in Oregon. <laughs> Thank you again. We're uh, smoking a little little of the uh the cherry picker yep. it's good but uh again back to uh the, the brownie the brownie here which um, let me t show you there's crumbs of it it's so moist it's just it's, just, it's yeah it's sticking around to the sides there's really it's not a so lot of good. stuff got a lot of stuff in here guys i don't know if you guys oh, can God. read but there's the list of ingredients right there i mean there's not a lot of stuff in there it's all natural you could pronounce everything yeah you know it's not like That's it's not like going and buying a hostess cake and having all these different types of chemicals and stuff in it there's none of this yeah. this is this is this is organic this is um again we we, we want to stress that it is gluten free and it is dairy free mm -hmm. so if you have any issues check these guys out go to relief buddies go to reliefbuddies.com check them out um i think they're on instagram yes um, they are okay on they get on instagram you can type in relief buddies i'm sure they'll, they'll, they'll pop At up relief underscore buddies yep this is the picture of uh you know what they are the camera's not bright or uh real super clear but uh yeah go check thomas's go talk check thomas's page out um We've had a few products from, from his farm, and I will say this: um, everything that I've gotten from this from this gentleman is top notch. Yes. Um, you need uh, any type of <coughs> relief, you know, from your CBD products. And they can even He's, give you uh, like advice about it, yeah. you know. Yeah, I mean, if you've got questions, if you've got questions, you're like, you know, well, I'm dealing with a lot of joint pain, or I'm dealing with anxiety, mm -hmm. or I'm, you know, I'm dealing with with this nausea or, or, or whatever, um, you know, reach out to anybody in the the hemp family here. Ask questions if you don't know. Yes, please. Um, you know, there's there's a lot of things that uh, you know we can answer good very easily. You know, good resources mm -hmm. of information would be like um, people that have been in the business for a long time, like uh, DM Blair, mm -hmm. OG, uh, uh, CBD Smoke Doctor. He knows what he's talking Taz, about. Taz, 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 Taz definitely mm -hmm. knows what he's talking about. Taking a voop. Taking a voop. These guys. These are all, all people. They're veterans all very of the, the industry. Yeah. Um, yeah. Check we them out. have learned a lot. Just from, from these following guys. them, from just, from following them, and yeah. then having conversations and just reviewing their products. It has been that a was an amazing brownie, Thomas. Um, yeah. <laughs> by far, like one of the best he's brownies not I've a, had. He's not a real like pastry kind of brownie nope. kind of person. No, nope. I don't eat this type of stuff. No, like even that was even good. even before he was like, yeah, I don't know. He's like, I don't know about the brownie thing, and I'm like, trust me, trust me. It's good. Brownie. You guys have you guys have an award. You guys have an award product here. I can tell by the here. doseness. <laughs> um, yeah. Again, I love your packaging. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, can't stress enough that I love that. Not only is it zip locked, but it's hermetically sealed. It's 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 yeah, sealed. Yeah, you see up up on the top there. There's like actual gash marks. Yeah, I'm trying to rip it open. <laughs> um, so when you when know. they seal it. 
that the factory it's they mean sealed. Business. It's sealed. <laughs> We've had packages that come that are just zip locked, and you could. I mean, and, you know, normally you don't have a problem with it, but I like something when I, I like to rip something open and yeah. you get that initial wow. Okay. Ooh. Woo. And I will say that when you when we opened this, this definitely had an aroma to it. Chocolate. Cocoa. The cocoa in this is amazing. I told, I, I think I said it on Instagram. Oh, it still smells good. I mean, it, you smell it. It smells like grandma just cooked something. It does. Like, where is she at? I'm going to tell you right now. My, my grandmother was German and, and she get you one used of to these, make all kinds of get chocolate Get you one of these. Shit. Get you a nice scoop of vanilla ice cream. And we grew up in Hershey. A little chocolate sauce. Please. Forget about it. And have yourself a midnight snack. Because I'm going to tell you right now, you're going to sleep good tonight. When a Hershey girl says that that chocolate smell is amazing, trust me, it's amazing. I had to grow up smelling chocolate every day of my life, okay? Is, you gained 10 product. pounds just by smelling the damn food. Again. Or the air. <laughs> I was not a, uh, I was not a CBD believer when I first started this business. Uh, no. Before I got into it, I was not a believer until I met Blair. And, and I was skeptical. Um, I am not an edibles person. Not that there is not a place for them and not that, I, you know what? I don't want to eat something and wait 45 minutes. That's just how I am. That's a personal <laughs> preference. It doesn't mean I have a problem with them. You're right. But I'm right. gonna say this. I'm gonna say this right now. This is by far one of the best products that I think that I've had, um, edible wise. And I I've had I've had um, yeah. you know gummy bears and things like that. You know they're great and you know whatever. But as far as taste and texture and flavor, uh, flavor, you know That's aroma, uh, the the whole nine yards. With me, knock the camera over. Whole nine yards. Um, the whole, the whole, the whole packaging is it's good. I would recommend. Okay, what would you give on a like flavor meter? Oh, flavor! I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna give this an eight point seven on flavor. There you go. Eight point seven on flavor out of ten. You know what? I'm gonna tell you right now. How about I don't eat level? brownies. Moisture level. I'm gonna say this is good. On the on the on the must need milk, absolutely have to have it with milk to the uh, I could take it or leave it. Doesn't need it at all. Got a seven point five seven eight on that. Don't really need Pretty milk, good. but I'm gonna tell you right now, it would couldn't hurt, but couldn't it's, hurt, but it, it, it's still it. freaking nice. You yeah, don't need to. You don't need it. You don't need it. <laughs> you um, really don't. I I don't have. There's no like it's not stuck in my mouth. It's I don't have yeah, any there's dryness. No there's no yeah. Some some edible brownies, like some edibles, period, get mm -hmm. very dry. They leave your mouth feeling very dry when you eat them. They're like you bricks. need you need you need a, a water or milk or something. You know what Not I this. don't like is is the fact that some of some people think that thicker is better, like as far as like edibles and stuff like that. It's no, not always the case. It's not always the case. And nope. these guys had the perfect, yeah. like it was width. about a quarter inch, quarter inch to yeah. three quarters of an inch thick, and you can perfect. tell it, it got squished a little bit yeah, in because okay. in, in, of the packaging. But I'm gonna tell you right now. It made up for that with the moisture level. It Seriously. was dense and just. It's better the, than tasty cake. The that's sweetness the level on it <laughs> is the sweetness level it, on it was perfect too. It was not sickingly sweet. You did not need that milk for one for moisture level or for two because it was too overly powerfully sweet. You know. Yeah. It looks like we're running out of time here. So yeah, folks, I think we're just about up. But uh, uh, thanks check out, for tuning in again. Yes, check out Relief Buddies. Yes, check Relief Buddies out and stay tuned for us because guess what we're coming up with? We got our own line of some concentrates coming up and we got a review. I, we got a review of uh, the Evolve um, Plus and the Evolve Plus XL. There are concentrate pens coming up yeah. very, very soon with some product from DM Blair. So, like, subscribe, comment. Again, if you're 18, Hit the roads. Everything we do is CBD. Everything we do is hemp oriented. There is no THC involved in any of this. So, nope. all right, guys. And if there is, it's a below the legal it's limit. It's below the legal limit of point Thank three. Thank you. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. All right, guys. Take care. Peace out, Cub Scouts. <laughs>